we're going to be going over what is included in the Angio Seal kit. Um, this is uh, a device that's made by Terumo. It is a um, closure device that's used at the end of a case, uh, oftentimes when you have gotten femoral artery access, to stop bleeding at the end of the case and avoid having to apply manual compression. So there are a few different versions, but but most of them are are relatively similar. The one that we commonly use is this is the kind of the traditional angio seal uh, kit, and <clears throat> this is a six French size. And what is included in the kit is the introducer, which has this inner stylet, the introducer, the actual angio seal device, and then a wire uh, for actually putting on the uh, putting on the introducer and taking off your uh, arterial access sheath. So just to kind of go through how everything works here, one of the first things you can do is you will assemble the introducer like so. So you'll just kind of put the inner stylet into the introducer here, and you see that there's an arrow here and an arrow here, and this will just click into place, and you can hear that little click. Um, and then what this particular device does is it has uh, these little holes here on either side that um, basically connect all the way to a hole at the top here, uh, this little hole here. And this is used as an indicator for making sure that you're actually in the vessel. So once you bring this part of the introducer into the vessel, blood will flow and you'll actually see it squirt out of the tiny hole here. Um, and that will let you know that you're in the vessel with the device. So that's one. And then what you have here is the actual angio seal uh, device. This is, you know, we keep this kind of in the foil. Uh, until we absolutely need it to kind of avoid any type of contamination. But basically what you can do is you just open it um, from the top. It'll show you on the packaging where to open from. And you'll have your little angio seal device here. And this is what you will actually use to close your um, arterial access point. So for the sake of just, you know, kind of the unboxing here and for explaining how this actually works, we're going to actually deploy it here um, and then I'll show you kind of a more representative example with a different video uh, as to how this works. But basically what you do is you kind of get into your vessel of interest, you keep the introducer and you replace it with this device here. Um, like so. And this also has an arrow. So as you kind of plug this in, what you will do is just make sure that these arrows line up. And when you actually plug this into place, you'll hear a click. What that click signifies is that the anchor here has been released. And you can see it right there. And then when you actually remove it, you'll pull back like this and you'll hear another click. And this means that the anchor has been locked into place. Now it does not move anymore. And now what you'll do is you'll actually pull back this whole device. Here. We'll use this to kind of keep our anchor into place but you'll pull back this whole device and you'll see that there's this collagen plug that actually comes out and you will pull all of this back and then you will see that there's this little tamp down device and this you will use to actually tamp down the collagen plug that's now on the inside of the patient and you will do that until you see a little black indicator right there and that lets you know that you've sufficiently tamped things down and then you will grab some scissors and you will cut right above here 
and then you will remove this and you will have your suture which is sticking out and then what you will do is actually go down low, low enough flush with the skin and cut and you have your anchor that will be inside the vessel you'll have your collagen plug which is this um, this right here which is just outside the vessel and then suture leading up to the skin but you've cut it flush and that will give you hemostasis so this is just kind of showing you the different kit components here um, and uh, but we'll do a more representative example using kind of a demonstration here with one of the other videos but this is what's included in the angioseal kit and that's how to kind of use the pieces together